So welcome to Don Bosco Secondary Bidia School run by the selections of Don Bosco in the province of Eastern Africa. The purpose of the school mostly is to educate the poor young people. This was the main purpose of the school. The school began very low, but currently we thank God that we have enough students from all over Tanzania. Uh, this year we have 991 students and among them 604 are boys and 387 are girls. We are trying to keep the mission of Don Bosco and among them, some of them are under sponsorship. We thank the world wishes and the benefactors from here and there. They are really helping us. And students are lively and we welcome you to Don Bosco here. Thank you. Many things which make Don Bosco Lydia to be special. In our school is a Catholic school. Uh, every day in the morning we have mass. So they are helping us in spiritual matters to, so as to strengthen our faith and to be a good Christian. And then we have school library. Uh, in our school library, it's a very big library in which it contains a lot of books in which each and every student will be able to wait and so as to, to success in his or her life. In the side of school, we are living with Galatians, teachers, there's non teaching staff, and we are operating with them. In our studies, they always help us. Also, in sports and games, we always cooperate. We pray with Galatians, non teaching staff. Also in the side of Foster, we have our sisters, sisters of Notre Dame. They are contributing with us in different things. When it reaches time for prayers, we always pray with sisters. When it reaches time for studies, they help us in our studies. Uh, well, as a social affairs minister here at school, uh, firstly, I'm dealing with the issues of entertainment and the issues of media, but all in all, my role is that to entertain the school and to make sure that the school is aware of everything that is going on inside the school and outside the school through media. The students, they must be entertained. When we have celebrations, that is the part where I have a lot of work to do because I have to make sure that the entertainments are well done, the decorations are well done, the media club is doing its work. So that's why I mean it's very, very important. We conduct a lot of games, a lot of sports. We play basketball, there is volleyball, there is football. For girls, we have women's soccer, we have netball, and they play volleyball too. As you see, these are in the basketball court. These are two basketball courts, and there we have the netball court. On this side, we have the football court, and far away beyond the football court, we have the frisbee court. So, a lot of games are played in the basket. When we are talking about academics, we have so many facilities. We have the library with fully equipped books. We have the laboratories, which are the new ones. And also, not only that, on the side of the sports and games, we have so many fields around our schools. So a student may just be doing sports and games in a very comfortable way. There are so many facilities which can support students to learn in the class, at the same time, outside the class. When we are talking about uh, the administration, the teachers and the students, Students must be at the center. All of us were just observing them. They are supposed to be at the center. The teachers are just helping the students. The administration is helping both. There are so many criteria to be considered. Not just a teacher. What do you have more? What are other extra things which can make you to be in a school? 